The Medal of Honor is the highest award given by our country for acts of heroism and valor in combat. This is the story of one hero. I was one of these individuals that went to ROTC in high school, and I knew that, that I was going to go in the Army. By January of 1968, Dix was a Special Forces advisor working with the CIA in the vicinity of the city of Chowdok. At that time of war, I knew that, that something wasn't right. My business was intelligence. I knew the area. So I got on the radio and found out that Chow Duck was uh, under attack. It was the eve of one of the war's turning points, a massive Viet Cong invasion on the New Year holiday of Tet. Once we got into the city, um, we could see no help was coming and things were really bad. They were worse than I thought. The city was totally under control of the, the BC. For the next two days, Dix and his handful of indigenous troops fought house to house, rescuing over two dozen trapped civilians and conveying them to safety. Each time we pursued taking over some of the, the high buildings, the big compounds, I was able to leave somebody there because if you didn't do that, then as soon as you leave, they're gonna come right back. Outnumbered and facing a torrent of enemy gunfire, Dix's small unit persisted and was able to capture critical buildings, a litany of enemy soldiers, and a key Viet Cong operative. The incident was a rare decisive victory in the otherwise panicked chaos of Tet. Those of us that wear the Medal of Honor know that you can't let, you don't let your, your buddies on the left and the right down. You just do what's right, and they'll do it for you. And that's what makes this country so great. Find more at moments.org.